10 working days down, 10 working days left to go. We've got huge opportunities, smashing it in Europe already, well on track in UK. So we should get 16,000 sleeves and uh, 150 Wolverines. In due this week for German speaker, we got one tomorrow and one Thursday. The person to do the most calls within the hour of power hour gets to go home early at 3 p.m. between two and three. So they started to finish at three. Same thing in Europe as well, but it's separate competitions. It takes three years to build a business. And I think you spend a year like trying to get things off the ground, just working with absolutely no sign of light in your tunnel. And then second year, you start to see shimmers and it stops you from quitting because you know, okay, there's light at the end of this tunnel. And then by third year, all of the groundwork that you've done over year one, year two, the networking, the finessing the product, the getting the pricing structures right, all of that comes to fruition and then bang, everything starts to make sense. When I first started this company, originally we were retail. And with the first three years, it took two years, not a lot really happened. And the third year we did well like really well. And then like, obviously we stopped doing retail and we focused on wholesale. And when we did that, we started focusing fully in 2016, like dedicated a team on there. And then from 2016, it was still like two or three years until we made any money. Like you can set up a lemonade stand and sell lemonade straight away, but your business isn't gonna mature and get to its potential for a few years, especially if you're playing a long business like ours. And what is a long business? A long business is where you have to build relationships, make networks, generally make the market understand what you are. I think that once people use us, it's very easy for them to be like, why, are, why weren't we using JLC the whole time? Firstly, a little bit of sad news. Donna is leaving us. So she's getting a job closer to where she lives so she doesn't have to travel. Um, she'll be leaving us on the 12th of July. So this week, me and Kat will be doing um, interviews um, as standard. Well done to Paul and Charlie so far this month. Only 12 major errors we've had, so the guys are doing a really good job and for a really good score this month. We've been trying to get under 1%. We haven't done that since August, so yeah, let's keep pushing with that. Doing a really good job. Perfect, thank you. Let's have a big week. What's okay. your plan for the week? I want to make sure that all the stock is away and all the locations are updated. Six my diet. Don's <laughs> just giving me that. Oh. So that's torture. It's really mean. <laughs> Proper now this week for end of month. So we'll uh, start looking at everything, deliveries where we're at. Go from yeah. there. I don't know. Uh, God, I actually want to get a haircut. Jack Walsh, you have a massive He's deal. Been off his the... <laughs> <laughs> so what is the order for? About 16,000 sleeves and 9,000 Type-C to display cables. How long's the deal been in the process for? Since the beginning of the year, actually. Okay. So yeah, so it's been a long one, yes. Yeah. When's the uh, expected arrival date? Wow, should have been like last week, but yeah. that's the way it goes. Not everyone can be as quick as us. We can get back to the customer, so we got to think, you know what? We'll let, we'll give them 24 hours. We'll get, we'll give them 48 hours. <laughs> Brown, who do you think is going to win power hour? Um, I think Liv. I'll go for live too. I'm gonna say live. Yeah, I'm gonna say live. Probably, probably live, probably live. Definitely. I reckon live. <laughs> live does some crazy numbers, but I'm gonna see if I can try and tackle live. So I'm gonna see if you're I can be, uh, yeah. I'm gonna back myself as well. You think you're winning? I'm gonna win. I am gonna win. Okay. Power has begun. <laughs> Started. Oh, brilliant. Mm. Yeah, that's the yeah, I'm going to try again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I actually got 19. 19? You need to get that every day. I'm glad I didn't do 19 like halfway through. <laughs> that would be the note of me. Jack Walsh, what happened? You said you were going to give them 48 hours. Uh, that was yesterday, so we're still within time. It came in. Oh, it did? Yeah. Oh, sorry. Wait, no, 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 it didn't. No, no, was talking. that another one? That's a different one. That's a different yeah, one. Yeah, you get confused, man. You okay. get confused the numbers. Hopefully the other one should be, um, who knows, man. It's out of our control now. It's with the customer, so it's with our customer's customer, so I have no control. I was just speaking to Owen, and he thinks that what we should do is change our name of the products back to Jammy Lizard, so we're JLC who distribute Jammy Lizard products. 
Now for a quick history lesson in JLC. In 2010, James Lake started an eBay business selling board games, but he needed feedback in order for customers to trust his brand. The game's conversion rate was slower because of the higher price, so he decided to sell cheaper phone cases on the side to generate positive feedback. Those phone cases were hit, and James was ready. He doubled down on the phone cases, and that's how Jammy Lizard was born. In 2014, when the business went B2B, the name Jammy Lizard needed a revamp, so it became JL Corporate, and further in 2020 to JLC Distribution. We've maintained our trademarks, so I have Jammy Lizard trademarks worldwide. It would be nice to be JLC Distribution who distribute Jammy Lizard. If we do that, we would initially start by doing it in Europe. And if that goes well, we would roll it out. It's not a determined decision yet. It's actually on my list. I do a list and the list is like my to-do list for the day. It's on my to-do list to sit down and give this some consideration. What would getting breakfast tomorrow mean to you guys? Everything. It'd mean a lot. Do you have any words to say to sales team? Have they done it? Don't know yet. Do you have They've any words? They've done it. This is for you. So you got breakfast. This is for the salespeople. <laughs> Mostly Joel. Mostly Joel. Joel hasn't been in for like a week. I don't care. For Joel. Oh, that's cute. But that is really nice. That's that really, really nice, nice. Of him, yeah. Uh, can you explain what breakfast is? Once we reach a certain figure as a sales team collectively, we will get breakfast for the rest of the company. From a delightful burger van around <laughs> the corner. Are we getting breakfast today? Well, I think we are getting breakfast today. Yeah, I it's, think it'll be a good it's day. It's Charlie's today. thank you. It's so motivated are you us. Yeah, it today? yeah, it's motivated us. Charlie, you'll get a chicken messy tomorrow. Hey, don't worry. <laughs> I love him. <laughs> Yesterday was a monster day in UK. Two times breakfast, so big, big day. We did those kind of numbers without actually getting the big deals that we're expecting. But we have huge deals which haven't even come yeah, and they could have come in at the close last night, so that would have made it like a monster day. I think we're gonna win breakfast just with run rate business. When the big dog comes in, bang, it's gonna be crazy. Owen and Laura have got a team's call in a second with a potential German speaker, so that's gonna be very good. If anyone watching this is able to work from Almelo, which is a town in Holland, and you're a native German speaker, then please get in contact. We need people who can sell in native tongue to Germany because that's gonna be our biggest market soon. Hi, I'm Rhiannon. I work at JLC, I'm sales support, and I am leaving. What's the reason for you leaving? <laughs> the reason? <laughs> the reason, <I'm> sorry. <laughs> I'm you're, nervous. You're, you're getting to tear enough already. So basically, I've decided to do a master's. Back to uni, up north. What has your favorite moment been at JLC? Oh, that's difficult to say. There are so many to choose from. I did really like when we all went up to the football. Like, football for the, yeah. With Panacea, that was really fun. It's nice actually meeting customers. So that was really fun. Also, just kind of, I feel like every day, off, uh, moments in the office, where everyone's just kind of, you know, I probably shouldn't say messing about, should I? <laughs> <laughs> Do you have anything you would like to say to anyone at the company? Wow, I can't think of anyone to single out, but just to everyone really, I'll, I'll miss them. They've been lovely to work with. You had no issues with anyone. Who is your favourite? Oh no. <laughs> I don't think I can choose a favourite, can I? <laughs> Everyone's so nice. I guess if I have to choose a favourite, which I guess I do, I'll probably say Benji, just because he's always oh. really lovely and yeah, he's been very welcoming and it's just always very nice. Who is your least favourite? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I don't actually know if I have anyone I don't like. I feel like, I guess if I had to choose. You got breakfast again? Again? Well, no, oh, today. today. Yes, who won it for us? Is it Joel? No. Sleep oh. <laughs> Rick. Well, not Joel. Yeah, it's it? not going to be Harry. It's, it's not Harry, it's, it's not Joel. Nah, it's a busy day for Ricky, it's still We're busy for Ricky. <laughs> so yeah. I, I'm going to give my pleasure to Ricky. <laughs> I don't know that's wrong and it was Penny and Owen. But it was Penny and Owen. It was Penny and Owen. Penny and Owen. Thank you. Yep. That's for breakfast. Disappointed. What's delivery? What you got? What is all this? A lot. A lot of what? Boxes. Products. What's in the boxes? <laughs> you don't know? I don't know right now. Do you want to open one of these boxes right now? Sure. What's in the box? I bet it's a boring one. Oh, yeah. Glass. A lot of glass. New chest. Gracias. <laughs> It's come in, yeah, yeah. I'm just dealing with everything now. Questions got to be answered. A couple big ones. A few big ones, yeah, oh, really good. You don't seem too happy. <laughs> yeah, I just, there's a lot of questions i got to answer right now. Right so now, okay. I'm up to it, but it's fine. Can't please don't make good sailors. I've got some bits I need to do now. But yeah, great. It's 
the hard part is answered, the hard part's done, and now we got to um, and then we got to make sure it does, goes all right, make sure it's all processed, make sure everyone's singing on the same hymn sheet. Okay, so tomorrow yes. should be nice and, nice and yes. chill. Hopefully in a minute. Happy Jack. Yeah. <laughs> Jack had some massive deals coming. He really did. <laughs> We've been waiting for him for a while since the beginning of time. I'm just trying to sort out all the pricing as so we're getting some scent air LCL to try and average out the price but obviously the customer's getting them all there because they want the thick. It's a really good day. Really good. Very good day. All of it came in today and we were actually we were thinking it might take a little while, some might come tomorrow, but all come in today. No breakfast today. What? Yeah no what do breakfast. You mean? Because we're having a barbecue! <laughs> It's Friday, it's the end of the week. It was a crazy day yesterday. Tuesday, we should pass this time last year, having Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday as like bonus days. Updates as to the German speaker. We had two no-shows. Two people didn't turn up for the interview. We had one guy turn up and he seems like he's good, but the problem is he's not a native speaker, so his German isn't as good as the native speakers. And also, we do want a native for the cultural piece. So potentially, we've got a candidate, but it's not the ideal fit yet. Oh my God. How's your week been? Thumbs up, thumbs down. Be the week. Be good. Yeah. Oh. 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 Oh, you still have a thumb. <laughs> <laughs>